The German Ministry of Defense announced that the Bundeswehr is set to procure 2,600 Panzerwerk Mein Deutsches Modell 22, DM-22, anti-tank mines, also known as Parm-2, with an option to purchase an additional 10,000 units. This decision is part of Germany's efforts to replenish its ammunition stocks following the transfers of military equipment to Ukraine. The Budget Committee of the Bundestag has given its approval for the production and delivery of the initial 2,600 DM-22 anti-tank mines, which are scheduled to begin in 2026. These mines will be provided by TDW, a subsidiary of MBDA, under a framework agreement. The total cost for this initial procurement is estimated at approximately 68 million euros, equivalent to approximately 72 million dollars. Notably, the funds for this purchase will be drawn from the resources allocated to support partner countries in terms of equipment and training. These resources are managed jointly by the German Ministry of Defense and the Foreign Ministry. Germany had previously delivered 14,900 DM-22 and DM-31 anti-tank mines to Ukraine, though the exact distribution between the two types remains undisclosed. This initial procurement of 2,600 DM-22s sheds light on the scale of DM-22 deliveries to Ukraine from Bundeswehr stocks, with more likely having been acquired from the industry. The DM-22, known as the Panzerwerk Mein Deutsches Modell 22 or Parm 2, is a tripod-mounted off-route anti-tank mine primarily used to secure roads and paths against armored enemy vehicles. It is a successor to the Parm 1 mine, equipped with an active passive infrared Sapir, sensor system that expands its tactical utility and increases its effective range from 2 to 40 m to 4 to 100 m weighing 20 kg, the DM-22 is armed with a 1.9 kg. 110 mm shaped charge warhead designed to penetrate up to 750 mm of armor, making it effective against both conventional and reactive armor. In terms of functionality, the DM-22 is an off-route landmine with a launcher assembly and fin-stabilized warhead assembly. It incorporates an infrared IR, sensor, the Sapir, which enables precise rocket firing with ranges of up to 100 m. This tripod-mounted landmine can be maneuvered through a 360-degree horizontal rotation and can be elevated to 90 degrees or depressed to 45 degrees. Crucially, the DM-22 has an arming delay of 5 minutes and can be command detonated or triggered by a fiber optic cable. An anti-tamper arming switch ensures that the launcher can only be secured with a specific arming key.